I take the train back into town. It's just past noon. I could head to school, although I wouldn't get there until fifth period if I'm lucky. Or I could go home, crawl into bed, and forget any of this ever happened. Hmm. But I can't summon the will to go back to the mansion. Oh, alright. I decide to go to the park and clear my mind a little. Overcast now. I heave an exhausted sigh. I sit down on a bench and stare aimlessly up at the sky. It's gray as far as the eye can see. The leaden clouds reflect my own inner landscape. Wonder if she's still sleeping, never doubting that I'll be there when she wakes up. Hmm. I murdered her and yet she forgave me. She forgave me so. What am I doing here, sitting on a park bench, staring up at nothing? <laughs> but at the end of the day, I don't want to die. No matter how strongly I might feel in the moment, that's a barrier I can never overcome. Your power is yours and yours alone. Okay, that's like a weird amalgamation of Captain Planet and Olmec from Legends of the Hidden Temple. <laughs> the choice is yours and yours alone. Mm. But that's why you mustn't forget. Uh huh. Master's words from long ago spring unbidden to mind. What exactly did she tell me again? Killing is bad. Hmm. Well, it fucked that one up. I still have time. The sun hasn't sunk below the horizon. If I can get back to the hotel before it sets, I can start over. I can't rid myself of these doubts. In the end... Okay. Yes, there's an option for staying. Okay, well. Well, anyway, Akiho told us to go home, so. See ya! <coughs> Gotta go home. Akiho will be mad if we don't. I've got to prioritize my own life, and that means not pissing off Akiha. Apparently. I recall yesterday's bloodbath. Back when the air was rich with the smell of death and blood. I don't want to see such a scene ever again. But if I stick around our seed, it, it's all but inevitable that I'll be exposed to that kind of thing again. If I don't want that to happen, I should return to the safety of the mansion. There's just one big flaw in my decision. I'm well aware of what it is. I am even conscious that this is wrong of me as a person. I force those thoughts out. I'm not running away. <laughs> well. That's what I keep telling myself as I head on home. <laughs> Everything will be just fine. Yup. Night will fall, and all this weird stuff will be resolved somewhere far away from me. Except for the fact there was a murder right outside your house. Oh! Hey. Hey, it's that middle school girl that threw the phone at us. Right. Just as I'm about to get up from the bench, a voice calls out from behind me. <laughs> okay. It's a girl I think I've never seen before, yet she somehow strikes me as oddly familiar. I'd wager she's a middle schooler, but she's not wearing a uniform. Looks like I'm not the only one skipping school today. All of it? Oh. Hmm. Oh. If she's trying to crack a joke, it's not a very good one. 
can't even grace her response with a laugh. But the girl doesn't look at all phased by my silent consternation. The girl doesn't get any closer than this. She neatly observes from a meter of distance. Oh, okay. Yeah. From a meter of distance between the two of us. Huh. Oh. Okay. Do we need one? I let us let out a sigh of relief at her unexpected offer. She's right. I feel terrible right about now, though I hadn't noticed. But as I'm suddenly brought back into the normality, I start feeling better and my breathing stabilizes. Yeah, Huh. I see. Well, an interesting warning. <laughs> For a while, certainly. Girl looked like she was ready to leave, but then she followed up with a strange question. Ma, umaretsuki kana. あ、遊びに付き合ってあげられないし。ああ。遊びに付き合ってあげられないし。ああ。遊びに付き合ってあげられないし。ああ。遊びに付き合ってあげられないし。ああ。遊びに付き合ってあげられないし。ああ。遊
Right. There was a human with her, too. Me. Me. Yeah. It me. I tried so hard to ignore the obvious truth. That, uh, someone might have gotten you involved in this. Instinct finally catches up, and I reach for my knife. I back away, keeping my eyes on the dead that have emerged from the forest at the edge of the road. Probably take your glasses off, bud. Mmm, well. Then. Up. Oh, is there one behind you? Well, that's strange. Suddenly, everything around me turns bright red. They're screaming. Sounds like it's coming from somewhere nearby. Yeah. My body jerks and writhes with pain like a wound up spring set loose. I keep twitching and squirming. My consciousness, my body, my vision, my world, all of it flashes in and out of view like an ambulance's emergency lights. Screaming. Screaming. So much screaming. It's like the sound is coming from my own mouth. Yeah, almost like. <laughs> oh man, rectangles. We got mm. a berserker here. I drop onto the ground with a thud. Can't move my limbs. They're not in any state to be moved. All that remains is the pain that sears through my eyeballs. Ooh, that's a fancy boot there. Mm. Well... The low voice sounds muffled. Pools of grease make popping noises on the heated up asphalt. Mm. Yet even until its final moments, Shikitono never realized the sound came from his own oozing filth. Huh. End. Yeah. Ah, there it is. Teach me, Miss CL. This segment has been created solely for the purpose of assisting troubled players and bears no relation to any actual persons or Tsukihime characters. Please be advised it may diverge substantially in tone from the main story. <laughs> oh. Play dubious hint segment number one. Yes. <laughs> My first Miss CL. <laughs> oh, cool. There's a trophy for dying. <laughs> but there's a trophy for dying every time, too. Yeah, I came with a new style for this too. Lost skis. タイトルじゃ先生なのに共感とはこれいかに。猫アーク。いや。まあ、そういう細かいところはどうでもいい。という精神は私を見てもらえばわかると思う。こんにちは。バッドエンド界のソムリエ君をセクシーすぎて本編
早速燃えてますなメガネ君道端でヒューマントーチはロックすぎにゃい Yeah, not the fantastic kind though You can't just survive setting yourself on fire こののの街道に地雷でもも埋まってんのそれはもちろんはち目撃されたのに一人で出歩いてしまったからですね。うん。あんな能天気の吸血鬼と一緒の部屋にいられるか、俺は実家に帰らせてもらう。という気持ちは痛いほどわかりますが、ここはぐっと我慢の子。<笑> well, I couldn't be. Akiha told me I had a curfew. <笑> well. 巻き込まれてしまったとはいえ、遠野くんはもう関係者なのです。当面の敵吸血鬼を何とかするまでお家に帰ってはいけません一旦外に出てもまだ最後のチャンスがあったでしょ yeah, I chose not to take it. そのあたりでホテルに戻ってしまうのがよろしいかと、oh. Oh. でも途中で逃げたのに戻るとか白いの交換とかやってたら恥ずかしいし。バンバン下げましょう。むしろ全編、塩対応でお願いします。<笑><笑> GCL。だってこの吸血鬼、恐ろしいことにトーノくんが何言っても交換できませんからね。へ、wow. ぇ<笑><笑>そんなことないと思うけどな。Wow. 怒るときは怒るよ。That sounds like a warning. <笑>でもほら、怒鳴ってるときの必死な感じが止まんないっていうか。What? I think that matters though, because if I'm not mistaken, the CL route has two endings. Oh. And for the, for the good one, you need a certain amount of arc affection. Yeah, they did that as、again. well. Wow, that probably doesn't matter on this place. No, but. え<笑><笑><笑><笑> Poor Neko Ark. <laughs> okay, so now we can reload. Might as well just stay at the hotel, right? Gallery? Oh man, look at all that. Got some good ones. Specifically, like. Those guys. This one. Aww. And, uh. This one. Oh, oh a couple、uh, variations. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. And, um. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> that one's okay, too. Yeah, that's a pretty iconic shot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A lot of these are just backgrounds, even. Yeah, that's some good ones. Oh, we've got a music player in here? Yep. So the other day, I actually fired up the original just to see、uh, if there were any changes with some of the early scenes. Uh huh. And I figured out why this game needed a remake so badly. It turns out, unlike Fate Stay Night, the original Tsukihime was super low budget. All the backgrounds were like. Blurred out photographs of real places. Oh lord. It was so. Shank. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I mean, they literally didn't have any money when they, they made Tsukihime. Seriously, they had no money. There's like character portraits, and then like the backgrounds are awful. The character portraits were also really rough in the original. They were, yeah. Like, I can totally see why that needed a remake. Unfortunately, Tsukihime made them enough money to make Stay Night. Yeah, and then they made them, them enough,、rolling. which made them more money than God. <laughs> yes. And funded everything they did after. Yeah. Basically. All right, fine. Let's go back to the hotel. Okay. So we'll miss out on some arc points or whatever? Well, we'll loop back to it because、oh, okay. I'm sure that is that second scene down yeah, there, which、right. is then going to loop into something at the bottom, which presumably the staying at the、yeah, hotel、okay. in the first place also goes to. Makes sense. So, I, I, just, I don't, just don't want to miss stuff, you know? Okay. Back to the hotel. I may have my doubts. I remember what Master said. Not asking you to be a saint. Just do what you think is right. Hmm. 
While a part of me is questioning my own sanity, I can't bring myself to betray Arquid's trust, huh? Yeah. She might not be human, but she still had faith in me. And she's a cute girl, so also, like, yeah. don't betray cute girls. Seriously, do you think she would be doing this if Ark was a dude? Probably not. <laughs> I mean, like, let's, let's be real. Yeah, I don't think he'd have the motivation. See, the problem is, Shiro also believed in the don't betray cute girls thing, which made his life very, very difficult in Heaven's Feel. Yeah, yeah. Because, like, do you not betray the cute girl that is Saber? Do you not betray the cute girl that is Rin? Do you not betray the cute girl that is Ryder? Do you not betray the cute girl that is Ilya? Or, or do you not betray the cute girl that is Sakura? Who is causing problems for the other cute girls at Correct. the moment. Correct, yes. Yeah, <laughs> that was rough. Uh, poor guy. Mm. She forgave an unforgivable sin without a second thought. Oh, no. There there were many thoughts before okay, the forgiveness. She had many thoughts, I assure <laughs> you. Next to that, my life is a small price to pay. I'd be ashamed not to offer it in return. Smack. Mm. I slap my cheeks to clear my head. The, the, the ones on your face, right? Hopefully. <laughs> he just stands up and yeah. smacks himself across the ass. And then a middle schooler looks at him like he's nuts. Then I stand up from the bench. I'm not going back to school, nor to the Tono Mansion. I set off at a run towards the hotel, not once looking back. Cool. Yeah, it makes sense. We actually have to confront her and see stuff. Last of the sun is slipping beneath the horizon as I reach the hotel room. <clears throat> I slip inside, tiptoeing to avoid detection. As long as I've made it before our queen <laughs> wakes up, she'll be none the wiser. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I saw that coming. I came back. <laughs> Unfortunately, she's both awake and absolutely furious. I don't know. She looks kind of just more disappointed than furious. Mm. 